हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल ब्यूटी ट्यूटोरियल्स इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ रिफैक्टरी द डिवर्सिफाइड एप्लीकेशंस ऑफ रिफैक्टरी मटेरियल्स इन सर्वल डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ इंडस्ट्रीज रिक्वायर डिवर्सिफाइड प्रॉपर्टीज टू मीट द फिजिको केमिकल एंड थर्मल रिक्वायरमेंट्स ऑफ डिफरेंट फेजेस in some industrial units more than one phase are present in steel making vessels like metal gases are simultaneously present in the vessel at high temperatures in the heat treating furnace solid reducing or oxidized gases are simultaneously present below are briefly described the properties of the refractory materials refractoriness refractoriness is a property at which a refractory will deform under its own load the refractoriness is indicated by pce pyrometric cone equivalent it should be higher than the application temperatures refractoriness decrease when refractory is under load therefore more important is refractoriness under load rather than refractoriness porosity and slag permeability porosity affects chemical attack by molten slag metal and gases decrease in porosity increase strength and thermal conductivity strength it is the resistance of refractory to compressive loads tension and shear stress in taller furnace the refractory has to support a heavy load hence strength under the combined effect of temperature and load refractoriness under load is important specific gravity specific gravity of the refractory is important to consider the weight of a brick cost of bricks of higher specific gravity is more than the lower specific gravity but strength of bricks of higher specific gravity is greater than one with lower specific gravity spelling spalling relates to fracture of refractory brick which may occur due to the following reasons a temperature gradient in the brick which is caused by sudden heating or cooling compression in a structure of refractory due to expansion variation in coefficient of thermal expansion between the surface layer and the body of the brick variation in coefficient of thermal expansion between the surface layer and the body of the brick is due to slag penetration or due to structural change on sudden heating spalling tendency is proportional to coefficient of thermal expansion divided by maximum shearing strain into under root thermal diffusivity and on sudden cooling spalling tendency is proportional to coefficient of thermal expansion divided by maximum tensile strength into under root thermal diffusivity permanent liner change on reheating in materials certain permanent changes occur during heating and these changes may be due to as follows change in the allotropic form chemical reaction liquid phases formative sintering reactions plc percentage liner is equal to increase or decrease in length divided by original length into 100 plc percentage volume is equal to increase or decrease in volume divided by original length into 
these changes determine the volume stability and expansion and shrinkage of the refractory at high temperatures thermal conductivity thermal conductivity of the bricks determines heat losses increase in porosity decrease thermal conductivity but at a same time decrease strength also bulk density decrease in bulk density increase volume stability heat and heat capacity types of refractory materials will describe in detail in next video so friends if you like this video then like and share also don't forget to subscribe this channel and press bell icon for getting notification of my upcoming videos